Good, Good morning, morning FHS. FHS. I'm Riel. And I'm Victor, and here are your daily announcements for Friday, December 8th. And today is National Pretend to be a Time Traveler Day. The virtue of the week is kindness. Kindness is showing you care, doing something good to make life better for others. It is being thoughtful about other people's needs. Kindness is showing love and compassion to someone who is sad or needs your help. Kindness is treating yourself and others gently. It is caring about the earth and all living things. As Loretta Gerzatlis wrote, if someone listens or stretches out a hand or whispers a kind word of encouragement or attempts to understand a lonely person, extraordinary things begin to happen. The cafeteria is now open during the afternoon break, which is from 2.25 to 2.35. They are also planning to have a traditional holiday turkey dinner on Tuesday, December the 12th. Attention students, are you eager to showcase your acting talents on this year's play? Join the Drama Fest Club and audition for upcoming original mini musical. The Drama Fest Club is set to present its production at Drama Fest in May. Good news, auditions this year are virtual. For details and audition requirements, reach out to Mr. Mallet at his email on screen or grab an information package from outside his classroom. Virtual audition submissions are due by December 15th to ensure that the play is cast before Christmas. Don't miss out on this exciting opportunity to be a part of the show. Student Council is offering students a chance to purchase SPC Student Saver Cards. The card allows students to receive discounts at many participating retail outlets. SRC will receive funds from the sales of the cards to support student activities. Once the card is purchased through cashless schools, students have to come into the main office and pick up the cards in order to activate it. Once activated, the card is good for one year. From December 11th to the 20th, the Positive Action Committee is having a food drive collecting donations of non-perishable food items as long as warm winter apparel for Greener Village. Some ideas of things you could donate are canned pasta sauce, kids snacks, canned meat, boxes of pasta, toilet paper, canned fruits, veggies, hats, mittens, coats, blankets, and socks, just to name a few. You can bring your donations to Mr. Champion's room in C-154. Get ready to witness the magic of creativity as FHS Pottery Club proudly presents its much anticipated pottery sale. Your classmates have been hard at work creating unique and stunning pieces that are sure to add a touch of beauty to any space. Not only will there be pottery, there will also be sweet treats also made by our amazing artists. The sale will be held on the 20th in room C016 during the lunch hour. Hope to see you there, FHS! Did you know that December 10th is the International Human Rights Day? To honor this day, FHS is hosting a Right for Rights event on Tuesday, December 12th from 12.45 to 1.15 in room E100 in the computer lab. All students or staff are invited to pop in for a few minutes to read about current cases of human rights violations and to sign online petitions. Last year, close to 4.7 million letters, tweets, and petition signatures from people like you helped victims of injustice. If you have any questions, please see Ms. McCarran in room C141. A reminder that today's open gym is ultimate. And please remember to not bring any food or drinks other than water. There's a nurse practitioner working in sexual health who comes to FHS every Wednesday. She's in room C029. You can also speak to guidance to receive this free and confidential service. This service includes counseling, free condoms, free birth control, testing, and connecting you to other specialists if needed. Oh shoot, oh shoot, it's not working. Do you see where he went? Universe X253. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Representatives from UMB will be in the guidance office on Tuesday, December 12th for on-the-spot admissions. Please sign up in guidance beforehand. Are you a current grade 10 student who could be defined as an independent, motivated self-starter? Do you like problem-solving, project learning opportunities? Then ESAP might be the perfect fit for you. Applications can be found at the office. The ESAP application deadline is fast approaching. They are due on December 15th and are to be handed to the main office to Mr. Connors. For more information about the program, please see Mrs. McGrath or Ms. Nicholson. And now, a message from the Curly Club. Hello, I'm Tashini. Hello, I'm Yosias. For our Civic Action Project in our World Issues class, we decided to start a club. The goal of the club is to educate people on black hair and how to do it. Alongside black hair care professionals in Fredericton, we will meet once a week to talk about black hair care, the struggles, and how we can improve the landscape in Fredericton. Here's a message about an upcoming book sale. 
Hey FHS. I'm Christine. I'm Emma. And I'm Hannah. And we're here for Miss Marshall's English class. All day December 14th we'll be holding a book sale in the Cats Cave. Starting December 11th through to December 13th we'll be taking book donations in front of the theater at lunch. Every person who donates or buys a book will have their name put in a draw to win a holiday gift basket. All of the profits will go to our school library. Hope to see you there. Finally, a message from Spanish Club. Hola, Hola FHS. FHS! My name is Gabby. My name's Annette. And I'm Camila. We want to talk to you guys about our new Spanish Club. We're making this club for all students in school who are interested in Spanish and Hispanic culture. And for those who speak Spanish at school and want to join us, the club's going to be in room C167 every Thursday at lunch. Our first one is going to be next week, and you're all welcome to come and join us. And those are all the morning announcements. Have a wibbly-wobbly, timey-wimey day, FHS.